guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today I am just doing a little bit of vlogging. Me and Valentina are home, of course. As most of you know, I stay at home with her. And I have a lot of, like, a few little things that I do. Like, I help my mom with her business and stuff like that. So, not sure when Axel would be, is going to be home. He is working. We got Valentina's juice right here. She's drinking her apple juice. She, she's eating her little snack. I actually tried some of these. They are the, they're kind of like Cheetos, but they're ranch flavored. They are addicting. Cookie? <laughs> I did shower in the morning. My hair is just air dried. And yeah, I'm just chilling. Sometimes I get ready and do a full face of makeup just because I want to and I enjoy doing makeup. So sometimes it's like, it's just something fun for me to do at home. Cookie. Cookie? Um, but yeah, so the plan for tonight is I have some work to do on my laptop right here. I'm sitting here at my desk. It's a mess. I just decided, like, why would I clean it for a video? I feel like people try to make everything look so perfect, and I am not going to do that. So, Lo we love this, like, professional angle. Like, you know what I mean? This is just such a vibe, the vent and everything. Um... We're gonna put, I'm using my toner because my face gets oily throughout the day after I wash it. And sometimes I just like need a refresher, so I'm using this. I'm obsessed with this Clean and Clear Lemon line. I love the face wash too. It's like an exfoliating face wash. It's so nice. But, um, so yeah, I'm going, I think I am going to go to the gym. I have some clothes to put away and like some things to do around the house. But yeah, I just thought it would be interesting to just show you guys like a typical evening with me and Valentina and what we do. She's just hanging out right now eating her little snack. I've showed you before you guys, like I always say in my videos, this is not our completed room. We are just like taking our sweet time doing things and there's reason for it, but yeah, so we have this other desk over here. There's my light. Um, and that's obviously temporary. So the only thing that's like good is that and the bed, but we don't have nightstands or anything. There's just all the work that needs to be done is over there. So I've just, I feel like I've been delaying the time to get my nightstands because I just feel like what's the point if the rest of my room isn't done? Why would I make like just this part look cute? So yeah, that is over there because we have like st decorations and stuff we're putting away. And yeah, so that's like the only thing that's like finished is just the bed and that piece of furniture. Those shelves need to be done and that her crib is obviously going to go in her room. We're in the process of doing that. But yeah, we are like just struggling with it because she really likes to sleep here next to us. So I'm just, if you have any tips on how to get your child to like comfortably sleep in their bed, like transition from your room to their room, let me know. I know I'm so late in the game because she's already 19 months old. So it's probably harder than doing it when they're older. And then this is just where I'm sitting. This is just real life. Okay. We got some frosted flakes over there. My laptop, a toner, her like drink, her juice, my diffuser, an open drawer, like four candles, one of them's burning, my makeup, my phone, <laughs> Axel's watch, my cute little slippers that I raved about on Snapchat, you guys. Go to TJ Maxx and see if they still have them. They were $6. They are the best slippers I own. Literally such good quality Hello Kitty slippers. So yeah, this is the vibes right now, okay? This is the vibes. Just sitting here on my little chair. I do love my desk, you guys. I found it on Facebook Marketplace because I'm just that kind of girl that, like, why would I go pay full price? I'm always looking on Facebook Marketplace. I'm obsessed. So I love it. There's a lot of things that need to be fixed, like the mirror. Need, I need a bigger mirror, and it needs to actually be on the wall, obviously. I want a different chair, some cute little decor pieces. But for now, it's fine. It's functioning. Excel sits here and works on the computer. I work on the computer do my makeup here. It's actually inspired me to do my makeup so much more. Like, I get ready a lot more. So, yeah. Um, I did show, like, a little makeup collection on Snapchat. It's just a mess. Valentina always gets into these drawers because they're not high enough for her not to get into them. So, yeah. And then we have a little present over there that Amina gave her and I for an early Christmas gift. You guys, she gave us the cutest 
most comfortable blanket. This is what she gave us. It's so it ha, it's like weighted. It's almost like heavy. Oh my gosh, cuddling under this is everything. And then I have clothes that are on the bed right now because Hey. Hi. Yum yum. Are you eating your snack? Um I pulled these all out of a storage box. All stuff that didn't fit me for a while and now it fits me. We have my favorite Calvin Klein windbreaker jacket. I know people are like not into this kind of stuff, but honestly, you can make it look really, really cute. And yeah, just a bunch of jeans and all that. The bed is not made. Today was just not one of those days. I usually do. I make the bed like 80% of the time because I can't stand seeing it like that throughout the day. But we've been upstairs doing stuff today. So, and then I have my little drink. It's just water with like two tablespoons of... Um, electrolytes. That's currently what we're doing. After I finish the stuff on the computer, I will get back to you guys. Ladybug. 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 Oh, yes. I see little baby fingerprints all over the fridge. Look. Look. Who's that? I know you want all of them, but the other three are holding pieces of paper. Oh, oh. I know you want them all, but you only get one because the other ones are holding I pieces of paper. I a cherry bite. Yeah, ladybug. I you me. Oh, oh. It's a Bug. Cut. Yeah. Here's our little tree corner, you guys. <laughs> oh my god. Just FYI, like now I understand why people with kids put ornaments from here up because you can see there's so many missing ornaments. The lights are pulled down. The ribbon is just a mess. It looked so, so cute at the beginning, but listen, I gave up because... I'm not about to be fixing this over and over. And then we got this little, oh, this came undone too. No wonder it's all weird. This tree skirt I got at Walmart. Um, it was, this is how it looks up close. It's just like a little cheap skirt, but I wanted a white one, either white or like a cream fluffy one. It was only $16 at Walmart. So I don't know, I like it. I didn't want to get red because it really didn't go with what we have. Also got these ornaments at Walmart. Got these ones at Target that came with all of these different ones. All the big ones are just came in a big box and then these small ones with the pink and rose gold came in a smaller box also from Target. Did I already say these ones are from Walmart? Um, and then we got this ribbon at Walmart too. You guys, like I said, don't laugh at my this was like the right way where this didn't break off here and all that, but again, it's been messed with so much. And then we have our star up here, which it was actually a red star that we used from a previous year. There it is. But XL actually spray painted it silver because I didn't want a red star. There we go. We don't put any gifts under the tree, not until um, Christmas Day, so Valentina can wake up and have all the gifts like appear here. So it'll just it's more exciting that way. So yep, that is what we have going on. I am about to get ready, put my gym clothes on, and I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm so excited. Your girl gets to go by herself, which I'm so happy. 
You guys, like, I get so excited. It's my me time. I'm also back on my calorie deficit. I've been very strict with it. And as soon as I hit my calorie amount, which I usually hit it, like, at about 6 p.m., by 6 p.m., I usually have hit the amount of calories I, I'm supposed to eat. So it's almost like I'm hitting my calorie, de I'm on my calorie deficit, but I'm also fasting unintentionally because I'm just always so hungry during the day. I'm not sure why, and then in the evening, I'm, I'm good. So, yeah, I'm also fasting on top of everything else. So I already feel the difference. Like, the thing about me is, and my family actually, my mom is the same way, is we fluctuate in weight so much that like we could gain like 10 pounds really quick if we eat shitty, but it's hard for us to be motivated because we have the kind of body type. And I've always been like this. The only time that it was actually the hardest for me to lose weight was after I had Valentina. My fat just was so much more stubborn. But typically, normally, and I'm in this stage now where my body loses weight really easy. Like, I already feel flat and small. <laughs> like, I can already see the difference. My, my bloating is completely gone. As soon as I get on my calorie deficit and just eat good and only drink water, then I'm fine. Like, immediately I already see the results. So, I'm very excited to see what's going to happen in the next six months. I'm going to be very diligent on it because I really want to see results and I want to have a good body for the spring and summer. And, yeah, I'm really glad, though, that I gave myself like a few months in a row of just not worrying about calories or food or whatever. I was just enjoying myself and I think everybody needs to do that because you can't live your whole life on like a calorie deficit. Um, it's always good to just go back into either a surplus or your maintenance calories because I feel like that kind of reboots your system. I don't know, for me it feels like I get like a restart. So now it's gonna be a lot easier. I don't know why it just turned so yellow so weird now it's gonna be a lot easier for me to lose weight so yeah I'm very excited about that okay I am going to go to the gym now I don't know if I'll be able to film there you know I don't I'm not comfortable with that yet but I'm gonna be doing high intensity interval training on this on the treadmill and um, probably just a little bit of like abs and hit training like um, jumping jacks, burpees, jumping squats, and um, squats where I like throw the ball in the air, which I've showed before. That kind of stuff just to get my heart rate up and then all, it's kind of like toning your body as well. And yeah, I will see you guys as soon as I get back. guys, I'm an actual idiot. I came to Smith's and then I was grabbing the, like I was literally just going to get like pineapple juice and cinnamon um, swirl loaf of bread and pancake mix and then chocolate chips to put in the pancakes and that's it. Literally that's all I was going to get because um, I just wanted to have like those breakfast things and then I wanted to get the pineapple juice because I always add like flavoring to my water and that's it literally that's all I was gonna get because um, I just wanted to have like those breakfast things and then I wanted to get the pineapple juice because I always add like flavoring to my water I just measure it out and it makes it really good and it's, it's just good for you so Thank God I realized before I got to the front, but I was going walking and I'm like, wait a minute, because I was thinking about which, like, I was like, what credit card, should I use a credit card, should I use a debit card, like, this was going through my mind, and then I was like, wait a minute, you're not using any fucking card, because your card is in your other purse, because I bring my gym bag with me, which doesn't have The bag that I use today is like my, it's my, di it's the diaper bag I use, but the other day when um, Axel and I went out for a date, I took like a dressy purse, like a crossbody purse. So my wallet's in there. I literally just have this cute little diaper bag with me today and no money. <laughs> 
and I do not feel like going home and then coming back. So we're just gonna abort mission and come back tomorrow. I'm here with mama. Can I have a hug? Mama. Can I have a hug and a kiss? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, my baby. Can I have a kiss? Mwah. I didn't hit my calorie amount today. I was 152 calories under, like I just didn't hit it. Um, even though I entered everything I ate today, I just, I didn't eat like a lot. So 152 calories under, and then I burned 400 calories at the gym. So I'm like in a 500 and, what did I say it was? 100, a 552 calorie deficit today. So I'm like, okay, I need to like drink something. I'm very thirsty, so I think I might have this right here, which will make me feel great. I love these drinks, you guys. So, so, so good. And this is going to be 120 calories, so I'll be, I won't be in such an intense deficit today from burning so many calories. Can I have a kiss? Un beso. Mwah. Is that a heart? And this is a star? <gasps> and that's, what is this? Is this a rectangle? <laughs> yes. Hey. Show me, me that you're vlogging. Wow. Wow, look mom. She's vlogging. Oh, hello. She's hello. <laughs> wow. She's looking at herself. Sarah. Wow. Sarah. Oops. Well, you know what? You write some good, really good stuff. You could make a quote book. There's, there, there's a. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I'm going oh, to try oh, something. Oh. Oh. I had to show you guys this really quick. My mom got this for Valentina. This is the hood. And it's a full little outfit. How cute is this? It's Adidas. It's like the, you know, what I mean, that material. And it's without feet, which is great because they fit in it longer if it doesn't have feet. Okay, you guys, here's a little sneak peek slash update on the closet. I just wanted to give you guys a little update to see how it looks so far. It's not done. There's a lot of things that need to be done to it still, but my clothes are officially in there. You can see I have shoe racks. I have a basket with all my sandals, a hook, some hooks for my purses, like my um, crossbody purses. To the left right here where you see this red thing with all the other stuff, those are my jackets. Excel built me this little necklace thing that has all these hooks. I still need to put my necklaces on there. You can see that on the right side of the wall. Um, and then he added these shelves above where my clothes are. That was all him. That didn't come with the organizer, which the organizer we have is a closet made T9 organizer. I'm obsessed with this closet. I have all my gym clothes and tank tops. I have an area for everything. Like I just, I'm so, so, so grateful for a closet, like it's crazy. There's my necklace organizer. I still have to add them all on there. I can have all my dainty necklaces. I have my heels over here. My sneakers like just chilling. It's not perfect. The folding and everything is like not cute, but I just wanted to show you guys reality, what it really looks like every day. So yeah, this was terrible, you guys. It was a nasty, disgusting cellar slash restaurant pantry. So it's had an insane makeover. We got this little rug from, I think it was Marshalls or Target. And then we got that bench from TJ Maxx. Oh, the rugs from TJ Maxx as well, actually. And then I have my little accessory drawer, sunglasses, rings, earrings, Valentina stuff. The one above it is lingerie, which is why I didn't show you the drawer above it. But yeah, that is it, you guys. I will show you more as they updates and things keep changing. Okay, you guys, we are officially out of the bath. Oh my God, I'm getting a huge, ignore how I look right now. I'm getting a massive underground pimple right here. What? I haven't gotten that in a long ass time. We are officially out of the bath. I'm wearing my 
sweats, but I have to make sure that this little girl's teeth are healthy and white. So if you have any tips on how to get brush her teeth, I've tried two different toothbrushes and I still have issues, so. And I'm not rough. I'm not sure why she hates it. She's always hated it. And her teeth aren't coming in. The only ones are coming in are the back, so I have to hold her down. Really quick. Look at how chipped my nails are. I have to take them off and redo them, but I took my nails off, you guys. I have not had my nails off in a very long time, which might not seem like a big deal to other people because it's not a big deal. It's just nails, but I decided I'm going to give myself at least two months. I wanted to, I want to say three. Yeah, I'm going to give myself three months. No nails. Only, like, no fake nails. Why am I getting an underground pimple? I've not... <laughs> That's what I call them. I call them an underground pimple. But, you know, those pimples that are just, like, really big, really hard, and, like, probably won't even come to a head. Um, <sighs> frustrating. Okay, so even after the shower, you guys, after you put your lotions on and everything on, you still want to wash your hands. So, so I'm going to go do that and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back from watching, washing my hands. So we're going to use my favorite product. Be careful. This is the Ordinary Niacinamide 10% and Zinc 1%. Very, very affordable. You can find it on Amazon. You can find it. I don't know if Sephora still sells it because for a second there they said that they don't, weren't going to sell it. Um, but just search the Ordinary Niacinamide. It is a high-strength vitamin and mineral blemish formula. You guys, this stuff is... This has actually changed my skin completely. Like, I will not be without this product. As soon as I get, like, to the last quarter of the bottle, I will um, re-up. <gasps> don't hit yourself. No, you don't hit yourself. That's sad. Why do you hit yourself? That's so sad to mommy. No. Then I go in with my eye cream. This is the Olay Henriksen Fresh Start Eye Cream. I actually found this at TJ Maxx. You just have to be very gentle which, with whatever finger you do use. I don't have a mirror, you guys, so. You really want to make sure you're just, like, tapping it. Do not rub your eye cream. And I always put it in the center of my forehead because I have lines. My freaking memory is full on my camera, so I can't even film on it anymore. I'm literally still sitting. So, that's all I do. My skincare is done. I usually just let my hair air dry. I brush it with a wet brush and just go to bed with it wet. Um, I do sometimes blow dry her hair because I don't like her to go to bed with her hair wet. Plus, it makes it really straight and silky and smooth. Let's go grab a book. Let's go grab a book. Yay! She's obsessed with reading, you guys. Are you reading? You're so beautiful. Every night is totally different. Our days are different every single day, but I just wanted to give you a little insight on what one of my days, yeah. one of my evenings looks like. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you want more fun, family, fitness, beauty, and bullshit content. Hit the thumbs up button and leave me a comment. Peace.